out of Quinta. Last time I had a lightweight and I didn't know what I was doing, dog. Like, bro, he beat the shit out of me. I ain't lying. All right, coming up next, it's a UFC lightweight division bout. Well, we probably trot out the term well-rounded in modern-day mixed martial arts more than we should, but this fighter certainly fits the bill. Oh, 110%. He can do everything inside the octagon. Where he is most comfortable is inside of that eight-sided structure. Ready. Here we go with round one. His knockout streak really has been the stuff of legend, knocking out contenders left and right. He's won it. Whoa! Oh! oh. Opens with the inside leg kick. Oh, big left. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. That right hand landed. Try to establish that jab. And he connects there with a punch, so pretty good striking display by him thus far. He throws everything so straight and so accurate. That jab is fast. Look at that jab. Right hand upstairs. Trying to establish that jab once again. Able to... He's got him hurt here. Oh! All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. You got the turtle in that kick. He loaded up on that right hand, too. Just missed with the left there. Big head kick land. Oh, there's a takedown attempt. Unable to get the fight to the ground. Nice job by the opponent. There. Nice job by the opponent defending the takedown. But now he is going to have to mix it up again. The first shot will not work. He's got to go one, two, three at a time to try to overwhelm him to give him too much to process to try to get this fight to the ground. Well, he's doing a nice job here blocking these shots. The chin is tucked, the hands are high. Pretty good job defensively thus far. Great job defensively. He's seeing everything coming. Oh, collar tie. His opponent's got him in the clinch. He needs to break away and get back to his range because he's taking punch after punch from his clinch position. Just misses with the jab. Nice. 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 Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. All right, then a left. He blocks the punch. Oh, just out of range with that punch attempt. Another punch to the head. He's really turning every part of himself into those strikes to the head. Another one. Up, up and left hand. Almost in range with the straight left, but that's a miss. A lot of high-level striking action in that last round. Daniel, take us through it, if you will. Tit for tat. Who has the best chin? It seemed as though they were looking okay. for that answer. Okay. Both guys took risks. What a fantastic round. Take a deep breath. Now listen, you probably lost that round. Ready to fight? Ready. Good. Big powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. How about it? Slips to avoid that left. Punch coming. It's blocked. Got the single collar tie. 
and that right hand landed square. Straight right hand now just misses. Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. Now his opponent's really on the ropes. His opponent's on beat street. He's hurt so bad. I don't know what he's gonna do to stay in this fight. Unable to connect there. He's so hard to it. I mean, he's cutting him down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Big kick lands. And both guys really throwing with authority. Man, he's just got a great feel for the striking realm early in this one. The timing is on point. He's doing a That's great a job of mixing guys, everything up. Misses with the jab there. Well, he has really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive than we saw in round one. And now starting to find himself in the pocket. Oh! Oh! oh His opponent could be out of here soon, DC. He's almost done. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, you don't know whether to run, hide, grab, or wrestle. He's a, he, I mean, he's confused. He's as confused as he was on his first test in elementary school. Flips the punch. Uppercut. Very good. Very good. Very good. Very good. Oh! What a fight. Ayaquinta gets caught with that punch. the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? Oh, straight right. Ten seconds remain in round two. Oh, beautiful jab by him there. Got that to the target quickly. He's dictated the fight with a jab. All right, so there's the horn signifying the end of the okay. round. We had a knockdown there, okay. but not a knockout. No, it wasn't a knockout, you but you can't take up. those shots. That big punch landed, and it sat him down. If he gets hit with another right one there. of those, it might be good night, Irene. Ready, fight. Ready. Third round underway. Oh, and he connects there, DC. Great job landing that punch. Whoa! Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, he might be out. Oh, straight right. Oh, shot to the body connects there. He hasn't really thrown too many body strikes in this fight, but now, as this fight goes on, he is not discriminating, working the body, and those shots are gonna count. Back and forth we go. A oh, really good job by him there to raise the guard, DC, and block those shots coming his way. He does a great job of blocking all incoming strikes. Nice job to raise the guard and block another strike there. He doesn't want the ringside position anywhere near this octagon. He has to understand that at any moment, if this thing goes down into the eye, the referee and the commission will have to stop the fight. Oh! Oh! That's as good a punch as he's thrown on. The punch that lands down the middle, the one that you don't feel, is the ones that land perfect, and that one landed perfectly. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? High level MMA defense there, able to avoid the punch. Nice job by Ayaquinta. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Quinta goes for the clinch here, and this is just a means by which to recover. He is stunned. Ooh, head kick lands, he's hurt. Well, this is exactly the sense of urgency you're looking for. Try to take the judges out of it. He is lighting them up now. 
High level MMA defense there, able to avoid the punch. Nice job by Aya Quinta. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Oh! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Well, that'll quiet the storm. Shot blocked by Aya Quinta. Right hand upstairs. Throwing that jab now again, the fighter evades. Oh. Oh, Gets up again here, but hurting. Oh! He's out! He's out, he's out! <laughs> A near perfect strike to end the fight and okay, end the night alive. for his opponent, who candidly may not have even seen that shot coming. So just the way he drew it up, exactly what he told us during fight week, played out here on fight night. He found a little opening in his opponent's defense and barged right through it to get the big knockout win. Well, he's going to enjoy watching this one back. Let's take a look at the replay of the knockout just a moment ago. It was right hand after right hand after right hand. Finally, he found the one that hit the exact sweet spot that ended his opponent's night. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 18 seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by knockout butcher. So the celebration is on with him and his team, and rightfully so. A monumental like result tonight as he gets the win by knockout. He spoke it into existence. He said over and over to anyone that'll listen, I am going to knock this man out. He did it in uh, an even more cool. impressive fashion than he ever could have imagined. being realistic. Come on now. Look at the 18 finishes for team knockouts. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Though. I got some to do. We're gonna make another video with Islam. If y'all want to make this personal with him, y'all make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Type me up with the kids. I know what's going on.